my god, he is barrier too. My view counter always so good. Seems right. That's a shitty ward, what the fuck? I don't think he needs Barry on Ori against uh, Nid, but if that's what he's used to, then I guess that makes sense. I'm gonna try to get a uh, appointment at the eye doctor for tomorrow. <laughs> so why it's all try using gunners when I get to the US. Such a waste of time, dude. Why does he even flash? I have no idea why Warrior flash like... It's a niddly with barrier, and Ori has barrier, like he can just only use barrier for that gank. Or just walk away, because I don't really do anything. It's all Lisa and then. Now let's say I don't know how far they send with Chase Cause they have... Vi And she was missing at the time, she showed now but She was missing so I don't think he would chase past like middle Or this ramp He based too wow. Gotta heal myself for the attack speed. Not sure where Vi is. She's probably around. If I can take it on purpose so I wouldn't get the cannon. What a bitch. My god, Riven is so fucked now. Riven already has a really hard time with Trinomir. And dying early, he's like, I don't know, dude. Like, Trent was always like the counter for Riven. Cause Riven's tankiness all relies on her shield, and her shield skills with attack damage. Uh, and Trinomir's W reduces attack damage, so. It's like the ultimate counter, it's like you make him weaker, and you make him less tanky, just by using one spell. And you can even max W on Trinomir in that matchup and do really well. Gonna get a level 6 here, so I can push out.
just taking coke right now. Don't really care. So when I get item, I wish I could get both, but I mm, think I'm gonna get another Dorn. I like getting another Dorn sometimes. Like if you, if you're playing and playing aggressive, I'd probably go for another Dorn. Why didn't I cancel him? It's so bad there. Go get blue, I guess. I was gonna roam top, but he's missing and he's turning to mirror. So, have fun. Loss. Jubbly. Sometimes it sucks to play Ori if you're gonna get ganked Cause Ori is so easy to gank You just fucking walk up and kick her back My god dude I wanna get Athens before I base. Oh my god, the fucking Cougar Auto didn't go. Is he lagging? Yeah, okay. He wasn't lagging anymore though. Like he's casting spells and shit. Oh my god, really? Janna, useful champion! I hate Janna. Like I never win games with Janna on my team. And if I do, it's definitely not because of Janna. Look, she like does nothing, dude. The fuck that champion. My god, Lee is so balanced. Literally, like, Janna just fucking sucks. Okay, she doesn't like suck, but for solo queue, at least solo queue, she's super terrible. All you do is like. I, she can kite back. Like, that's pretty much it. She can kite back pretty well. She's pretty good at, like, not dying. I guess. Um, she's not a fucking Janna fan. Never was. Ever since, like, season one, I hated having Janna on my team. 
amazing. Fuck, I saw him, but I didn't think he was gonna go. I'm so dumb. Shouldn't have died this time though. That was pretty bad. Top is getting destroyed like I thought. So gank. Diana doesn't do anything with setting up ganks either. Chinry <laughs> probably taking her blue. And now he's ganking mid. The pressure from my team this game. Blitz is here too. Literally, just like no lane has pressure except for mid. Like top lane, Trinibus pushing second turret, ticking blue. And bot lane, Blitz is perma roaming. I'll try ganking Trin. That's like the best we can do is getting a one for one. But that's not that bad. Because I get blue. And we actually have some pressure on the map. For another like minute or so. Let's see if I can get top tower. I'm trying to slow that for five seconds. I saved it. Not sure we can. Actually, we can probably go for this guy. Okay. He's fucking oom, dude. Go! Jump.
Oh, my mistake. Janus shield didn't really save me. I used barrier. So you know, maybe it looked like the Janus shield was a lot stronger. But the barrier would have been enough. I'm not saying that Janna is like, she doesn't do anything, I'm just saying that she does a lot less than like any other support champion, in my opinion. Unless played super well with a duo queue or something. Should have just backed off after doing blue, because I actually got it. I fucking knew this was gonna happen. I fucking knew Trin Rear was gonna be pushing under in about 20 minutes. Fuck. Maybe this does nothing against Trin Rear. I should actually start banning Trin Rear again. But I'm not first pick half the time, because it's random pick order. So I guess it doesn't really matter. If people keep tra playing Trinomir, he's going to be a perma ban in a month. Because he's really OP in solo queue. Just because he snowballs so hard and people don't know how to deal with split pushing. Luckily they did nerf ship, I guess, so... It's a tiny... Makes him a tiny less strong. It's not really Riven's fault, to be honest. Like, they misplayed the 2v2 top. They said, said he was sorry, so I guess he messed up. But one mistake, it's like you cannot even make one mistake in that matchup. And if, even if you don't make one mistake, you go even. I feel so alone, dude. Like, where's my entire team all the time? My god, guys, um, <sighs> I guess everyone is trying to defend the instrument of
There's like nothing we can do though. Like, if Tournament plays decently, we lost this game. Because we have to send at least three people top. And if we send at least three people top, they just push mid like they just did. And they just dove me, like, down here. So. We're just gonna slowly lose this game. If we force a fight, Tournament is probably gonna kill our Nexus. Oh fuck. I'm actually not flaming, he actually seems like a pretty decent guy. Yeah, the problem kinda is that if he gives Trinomir like the slightest advantage, he's gonna win the game. And if Lee died to Trinomir as well, then there's not much Riven can do, regardless of the pick. Like, even if he's fucking Rennington, he's gonna get shit on if Trinomir has two kills. Trinomir's not playing LCS because in LCS he wouldn't have those two kills. And I actually think he loses a lot of matchups early on. So people are just never gonna give him that advantage. So he's really high risk in competitive play. 
Whereas in solo queue there isn't really much risk because I don't know, because people are just not going to shut you down. And even if you get behind, actually, straight in solo queue, you can always just split push. Because people don't know how to deal with split pushing. Don't know if I should surrender. Guess I should. Alright. 